to have a lot is to like be normal, I guess. I don't know. Y'all be proud. I didn't buy a single thing. Saving that money. Like, I saw so many things I wanted, but I was like, <sighs> I'll be here again. All I'm doing is shopping, shopping, shopping. Shopping, shopping, shopping. Spending money, money, money. I have the money, but I need to start being strict with myself. Trust me, I read your comments. Everyone makes fun of me that I go to Walmart all the time, even though I never go there anymore. Like, it's like Twilight Zone to me if I ever go there. I probably go there maybe once every three months. Not even joking. And it's weird because I used to go every single day. Stopped going to Walmart. Instead, she goes to Target. So I decided that I am going to buy whatever I want. No matter what it is, how much it is, I'm just going to buy it. So I went, I did, I saw, and I conquered. I've been shopping too much, okay? <laughs> it's embarrassing. I have bought 13 purses and a lot of other stuff. We don't, have, we ain't gotta talk about it. If you guys saw the den right now, you'd probably pass out. I did not realize how much stuff we had. And how much stuff have I gotten rid of? How many car fulls to Goodwill has that been? I got a house full of stuff. Yeah, it's like a house full of stuff. I don't know how I even had all this stuff. Um, I had a lot of stuff down in the basement that I had forgotten about. It was a lot of like Christmas stuff, Halloween stuff, kitchen stuff. Um, stuff. Yeah, just like random stuff. Would you say you have hoarding tendencies? So I get a lot of people telling me that I'm a hoarder and I have tons of stuff, da da da. I want to let you guys know, I think it's a shopping addiction more than a hoarding tendency because I am on the daily. I have an actual section in the den, which I can show you guys in my vlog tomorrow or whenever, of an area. It's like my get rid of pile. Every single day, I put at least one thing in that get rid of pile. And I let my friends go through it or I give it to Goodwill, like it doesn't even matter. But if you're able to get rid of stuff every day, isn't that because you still have a lot of excess and necessary stuff? But I literally just got rid of a whole box of stuff. It just piles up and piles up until someone wants to look through it or what have you. In my opinion, a hoarder keeps everything they buy. For me, if I buy 10 dresses, I'm gonna get rid of two. Buying more than necessary, giving away the excess, so you can feel good about giving while still being able to keep lots of stuff? Sounds worse than a hoarder to me. I used to have so many journals. I used to have so many perfumes. Like I had moments where I had a large quantity of certain things, but I don't do that anymore. I get rid of a lot of stuff. You guys, every single day I'm getting rid of something. For me, I almost prefer getting rid of stuff than actually buying stuff because every time I get rid of something, it kind of feels like there's like a little bit of a weight just like coming off of my shoulders and it feels good. I love just like purging stuff, honestly. Creating the delusion of productivity and being helpful by giving away pointless dollar store stuff. Talk about being responsible with money, huh? And if you guys saw everything that I owned, you guys would be like, wow, she actually doesn't own a lot of stuff. It's actually kind of sad, really. Y'all, look at all this. It is thoroughly satisfying to get rid of so many things. So much. 
It's such like a relief, honestly. I have so many journals that it would literally make someone's head pop off. It's actually kind of sad, really. This isn't to be impressive. This is to show you how ridiculous, <laughs> how psychotic. All these poor trees. No, I'm kidding. I still feel like I need more, though. No, you don't. No? No. Hmm. Thank God they're recyclable. I have a lot that um, I'm using currently as well. I want to use them all, but I'm just like, how? I know I just showed you guys all the journals that I have. You guys have seen how I have a lot of earrings. I have a lot of chokers. I think that's where it kind of stops. I used to have a lot of scarves, got rid of them. I used to have a lot of statement necklaces, got rid of them. I mean, I do still have some, but not even half as near as much as I used to. I don't consider myself a hoarder, even though a lot of people think I am. I've been ordering so much stuff, it's so bad. I just, sometimes I can't stop spending money and other times I'm like frugal. There's no in between with me, it's really weird. I've gotten rid of a lot of clothes <laughs> lately, recently. I just feel like for a while there, I was just buying every dress on Porrid, like I'm gonna be honest, because I wanted a variety of clothing, but I kind of have like a certain style. And I feel like, you know, at my heaviest, it was easy for me to justify buying a bunch of clothing because it was like, I was buying dresses that would fit me for a long time because deep down I felt like I was never gonna lose weight again. So I feel like the smaller I get, the more I could finally be myself and experiment with my style and stuff. It's really sad when you go into Walmart and you already have every single pair of earrings that they have. So now we're gonna move on to Becky's mom. She got me this huge, like gigantic thing of makeup this has 116 pieces and it obviously comes with a storage so this is what is on the inside and I'm so excited because I've really been wanting to experiment more with makeup so now I'm gonna get to so I've been needing a new makeup case because the one that I have now is like probably the cheapest thing I've ever owned it's just like weebly wobbly and 